I can't count the numbers of keynote speeches or CSU presentations that bored me to death because of the lack of substance. But you have sometimes small, very modest players in the market that do great things and just don't talk about it. So guys, talk about it. Hey guys, another day and another trip to Munich. And let me share with you the three things I learned. So I listen to this. I'm scouting digital and tech trends around the world in order to bring it to you. And I've helped numerous companies to set up ecosystems of digital products and services and to increase their reach with attention hacking. Number one. I'm a diehard boy from Hamburg. But well, the people here in Munich and Bavaria know to do two things. First, they know how to brew beer. Mm. Maybe in 50 miles around here, there are 10 of the best breweries in the world and truly taste like it. And they know how to cook. This is an amazing Leberkäse. And believe me, I don't want to know what's in it, but really, it tastes amazing. And uh, I'm here at the Cafe restaurant, uh, my favorite place in the Munich airport. Today I met investors and insurers, and there is actually one thing that combines them. Uh, both um, were thinking about how could they share their story and how could they actually get their story and their successes more out there. So the topic attention hacking was really um, that we talked about a lot. The second thing I learned, how many stories and how many interesting projects there are, especially smaller and mid-sized insurers that the world has never heard of. I can't count the numbers of keynote speeches or CSU presentations that bored me to death because of the lack of substance. But you have sometimes small, very modest players in the market that do great things and just don't talk about it. So guys, talk about it. The third thing I learned is that um, from the outside some insurers may look um, old school and may look conservative with a little dust on the facade, but uh, behind it actually um, there are some players in the market that tear everything apart uh, and try to rebuild it. And um, I think especially from smaller and mid-sized insurers you will see some players in the future that are going to make it and with some exciting results. If it's going to be in 2018 or 2019 or 2020, I don't know, but I wouldn't write off all traditional insurers. No, 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 don't get me wrong. Still, the insurance industry around the world, the majority of carriers does not invest as much and doesn't do the things that's needed to use the digital transformation as an opportunity that doesn't hack attention, that doesn't deliver value to the customer and that doesn't set up ecosystem of digital products and services to conquer the hearts and minds and home screens of the customer. Hey guys, it would help us a lot if you could hit the subscribe button down there and to make us also grow here on YouTube. Thank you very much.